I have a video that I know you guys all really, really love. And you know, I'm not gonna be doing as much lip balm content on my channel in this coming year, but I know you guys all really like this video and I will be doing some from time to time. So I decided I would still do my updated lip balm collection for you guys like I've been doing in January the past couple years. And yeah, so I don't know what that was. Let's start. <laughs> So I'm going to start off by showing you the lip balms that I currently have in use. I always have one here on my nightstand, and so currently I have this one right here. So this is Holiday Cinnamon by Chapstick. And you guys know I always like to keep a tube lip balm on there as well, and I've had this Smith's Rosebud Salve one here since literally 2015, which is kind of weird, but at this point I can't take it away because it's just been there so long. So now we are going to move this way to where my bag is, and I'm going to show you the lip balm that I have inside my bag. So currently in here I have this lip balm, it is an EOS one in the flavor coconut milk. And I also have one lip gloss in here, and it is this Victoria's Secret one. Secret, oh my god, what the heck. Victoria's Secret in Kiwi Blush. Wow, and then I just went like that. What is going on here? My goodness. Okay, so there's that. So now here we are at these two bins next to my dresser. So this top bin here is filled with all of my EOS lip balms and this one underneath is filled with all of my lip smackers. So these tins on top are filled with lip glosses. So I've got some rolly lip glosses. I've got, let's see, this one here has random shapes like tins and stuff. This one with the ice creams on it has some squeeze tube lip glosses in it. This one here has the gummy bear lip glosses. This one shaped like a lip smacker. Inside has some rolly ones. And then this tin right here, if I can open it, here we go, has all of my little like stick lip glosses from Lip Smacker. And then the bin itself is filled with all of my regular, like more modern Lip Smackers. So now we are up on top of my dresser and this flowery bin right here is where I keep all of my baby lip slip balms. So if I just open it for you. So here is what this bin looks like. It's just got a bunch of Baby Lips lip balms. I really love Baby Lips because they are just so cute and colorful and I just, I just love them. They are just wonderful. That was the worst like description ever, but they are just really rad. So if we kind of migrate ourselves a little bit over to the other side of my dresser, I have this caboodle right here. It's got like these holographic stars all over it. And this holds all of my squeeze tube lip glasses. So this is just all of them in here. Let me know if you want an in-depth collection of those. But I really like this little caboodle and I like how it just fits so nicely on top of that organizer there. So right next to my art desk, I have this little makeup bag right here. And inside this makeup bag is where I keep all of the lip balms from my own brand called Star Balms. My Etsy shop is called Finch and Violet and it is linked in the description below. And these are the lip balms that I make for my own shop. So then if we come over here towards near my bed, you guys can kind of already see what I'm going for, but I do store a couple bins of lip balm under here. This is my random lip balm collection, so this is just a bunch of the random shaped ones and ones that don't really fit into any other category. I don't really buy random lip balm that much, but sometimes I get one as a gift or I find one that I think is cute and I want somewhere to put it, so that is how the random lip balm bin started. And then this last bin here is where I keep my rare and vintage lip smackers. So if I take out what's on top, you can see underneath all of the rare and vintage ones I have. I also like to keep a lip balm on my art desk. Currently the one that I have up here is by Blistex in Mary Berry. I like to keep 
My lip balm's kind of themed with the season, so I use winter lip balms in the winter. So before I show you my main lip balm drawer, I wanted to show you inside of my makeup drawer where I keep my lipsticks and like colored lip products. So this little bin just holds my lipsticks and tinted like lip products that I wear like for makeup rather than, you know, like lip balms. So it's pretty much mainly red because that's kind of all I wear when I wear lip products that's not like lip balm are sheer reds, bright reds, and dark reds. That's pretty much it. Sometimes we vary, but not very much. And now the part I know you are most excited for is this drawer right here where I keep my main lip balm collection. So in this upper left bin, I keep my Vaseline tins as well as my Nivea lip butters here. And I've got quite a few Vaseline tins, I really like them. And then underneath this one, I have one Neutrogena one. And then I have two little Vaseline, like the baby tubes here. I have Creme Brulee and Rosy Lips. Then moving on to the middle is where I have all of my Hello Kitty soft lips. So I have every soft lips stick from Hello Kitty that's ever been released. And then I also have the soft lips Hello Kitty cubes here. And I think I'm only missing coconut cream and peach mango. Those are ones I've never been able to find, but I'm pretty sure that I do have all of the others. Then if we continue moving in that direction, we have all of my chapsticks. So I have two of the chapsticks duos, and then one of the chapstick mix sticks. And then I have a bunch of the normal sticks below that. My favorite ever is Watermelon Splash. Let me know if you guys like chapstick, brand chapstick. Let me know what your fleet Oh my goodness, let me know what your favorite is. Watermelon Splash and the Candy Cane one, and then I think Cake Batter are my favorites. And then, if we continue moving that way, you may see something back here. Right here are some presents I got from my friend. She made me this, her name is Sophie, and her channel, I think, is Cloud Petals. I think it's Cloud Petals. She changes it a lot. <laughs> So, I think her channel is Cloud Petals, but she made me this, and it's so cute, and she wrote me a little note, and I just keep them here because I love them, and she's awesome. So, thank you, Sophie, if you're watching. Now, we're gonna come down here, and speaking of her, she also gave me these little labellinos down here, which are super, super cute. I love these. This one is my favorite. I think it's red apple and rose. No, red apple and raspberry, which is amazing, two of my favorite flavors. And I, then I think this is cucumber and aloe. Then I have two full-size Revos in pomegranate and strawberry striped cheesecake. And then I have these mini Revos in here, these mini push-up Revos for spring. Then moving on to this final bin is where I keep kind of the random assortment of the, like, kind of standard lip balms. If you see any that are Labello, they are also from Sophie. And yeah, I just kind of have a random assortment in here. Blistex is my favorite, this one in particular. And then, yeah, so I think that is all. Here is a little look again at my lip balm collection. So that is my full updated lip balm collection for the year of 2021. I'm sure I'll have to do an updated one again eventually this year, probably towards the middle end of the year. But yeah, even though I'm not gonna be doing as many lip balm videos as I did before because I just don't, I don't want my channel to become like a lip balm channel. Like I feel like I have bigger and better things that I want to do for myself. Like not that it's bad to do only lip balm content, obviously, but like, I just don't want my channel to become that because I have a lot of ideas for other things as well, but I still will do some here and there. So if you guys would like any in-depth, oh my goodness, stop talking so fast, wow. If you guys would like any in-depth collections of any of the brands or areas that I showed you today, please let me know and I will try and do them if I can. But yeah, I think that is it. Thank you guys for watching. I love you to the moon and back and I will see you later. Bye.